Hello everyone, this is Dana Reynolds and Rochelle Reynolds with Mastercut Gems. It's that time of year again. This is time for Rocktober sale. Um, just wanted to say this was going to uh, start this coming Friday, October 22nd. I think it's at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard yes, Time. Yes, it is. It starts at 8 o'clock. Uh, I just, I've been cutting a lot and I've been pulling old stuff out from 25 years ago, buying rough and, and old stones from Burma and stuff like that, just to give a good variety in this sale. I know with all the chaos and craziness that we're experiencing in the world and in our country, with inflation at an all time high, I have chosen not to be a part of inflation. I know that I uh, have debates with my wife Rochelle about this, but there's just something inside of me that I'm just not gonna be a part of it. I know what I paid for this material 10, 15, 25 years ago. I know the time I have to spend to cut the stones or recut the stones. So I am hoping that next year will be a better year for us all. But for now, I'm not being a part of inflation. I am offering the stones at the prices that you will have been known to expect from us. And I just wanted to pass this along with all the craziness, all the sadness, all the negativity that we all face in this era of time, I just did not want to be a part of that. And I hope that you will find something that I have cut that will be able to bring you a little joy in your life, a little livelier step in your step, <laughs> and that you will be able to afford without regret a nice stone for you to mount into something for yourself or for a loved one. So I have to ask, so does that mean for Rocktober, we're going to have great sale prices, correct? Yes, yes, That's what are. you're saying. You're going, to Good. Be, you're going to see the sale prices that you have uh, known to expect from us over the, the last 15 or so years. Uh, I don't know how long that I can keep it up because I cannot afford to buy the rough and a lot of the poorly cut stones to recut. For the last seven or eight months or year, I have been procuring and, and contacting all my people abroad and the prices are so outrageous. I, I'm seeing prices of rough that I could not sell the finished stone for what they want for the rough. That's just not sustainable or acceptable to me. I am a working class type person cutter. I try to have nice natural stones, well cut or as cut as well as I can cut them with the material that I've got to work with for the normal working person, the person who does not have that deep of pockets. So I'm doing it as long as I can. I hope that you'll support us because when you support us, it allows me to have the funds to go out and procure and call in favors from these old friends for 20 years that have known to accept me as a man of honor and trust and kindness. So I'm still passing this on to you all and will do so as long as I can. Rochelle's telling me to smile more, so <laughs> I'm gonna smile. But you know, it's hard to smile sometimes when you face adversity, but I am not negative, I am positive. I have a lot of faith <clears throat> and I do believe that we will aspire as a nation and a people of the world to um, step up to the plate and do the right thing when called to. Uh, that's all I've got to say. Didn't want to go so much into the dramatics, but I just wanted <clears throat> to let everyone know I am doing, and Rochelle, we're both doing our level best to keep a good quality natural stone at the best price that we can for you all to enjoy as long as I possibly can. Thank you so very much for all your support. We appreciate you all. We come to love our clients and we just wanted to let you know a little bit before the sale that we were not falling into the massive inflation that we're all experiencing today in so many aspects of our lives. We pray for you all. 
We have lots of faith in God. Some do, some don't. That's the path you choose. But we do, and we also want to make sure you all know we're going to do our level best to make sure that anything you get from us is at the best price for the best quality. Rochelle, you have anything to say? All I can say is I'm very excited about our October sale. Dana has been going through the vaults and pulling out boxes that I haven't seen in years and He's been cutting rough like a madman, and I have been so proud of him, but we're both very tired. We're both exhausted, but um, I will be posting vid additional videos this week and this weekend because I'm going to try to post videos of the gems, so just be patient with me because we have a lot of, uh, of recording to do, and if you have any questions, do not hesitate to send us an email. So the, and we are doing our best. We're working hard. We're working very hard. <laughs> so I hope that it, it, you know there's going to be a, a very, very, a very good variety of material. Um, and, and I mean, it's just you know I'm pulling out old stuff, stuff that when I did custom jewelry, I saved back a lot of pretty melee and stuff like it for my pieces. Well, I just do, don't do the bench work anymore. I'm more focused on cutting. Uh, if there's something I have to do, I'll do it, but I'm not into the casting, wax, wax carving, all those things that I used to do. So I did pull out a lot of my saved items that I was going to use for jewelry in my future work uh, that I see that I'm not going to do it. Let it go. Let someone else design something. Let someone else utilize it instead of it sitting in a vault gathering dust. So these are a lot of like, you know, really nice stones that I used for really nice pieces of jewelry that I won't do again. And I just wanted to pass that on as, long, as well as some of the other stuff that I had been hoarding back from like old Burma spinels and stuff like that to, you know, you just don't cut all your best at first. You kind of linger it out a little bit. Mm -hmm. But uh, there is stuff, I think I've cut over 50 stones in the last two weeks, uh, just really whittling away at the rough. So, still cutting this morning, editing photographs. <laughs> We've taken about another 300 photographs today. So, that being said, we just wanted to let you have a little update as to what was going on, what our mindset was, and we just wanted to pass this information on to you all because you are our clients, you are our friends, and we just want to say, hey, stay safe, do the best you can with what you got to work with, and um, we're going to rock on with Rocktober. We're going to rock all Rocktober <laughs> long. So That's thank right. you all for everything, and have a wonderful week. Thanks, guys.